Hello my friends, I've got here a knife, uh, it belongs to my father-in-law and he gave it to me this weekend uh, to sharpen it for him, uh, but there's something interesting about this knife, I just want to give it a little bit of a clean up and open the knife uh, and then not open the knife but open it like this and show you what make it interesting for me so let me just uh, clean it up a little bit this is how I received it and um, also I would like to know if, if you guys can say what kind of wood is that but the knife is um, at least 25 to 30 years old and um, my father-in-law used it op to open sweets, uh, candy packets and cookies and so on all the years. Uh, no hard work, you will see it on the knife itself, on the cutting edge. And uh, so let me clean it up a little bit and then I'll show you something on the the name of it and other descriptions there and so on okay guys I've uh, cleaned it up a little bit all over as, as best as I could and see the nice uh, grain of the the wood and I haven't got idea what kind of wood that is I checked up on internet where this knife came from and that is what makes me a little bit uh, confused so let me open it for you and then you will say see, see there is Japan there it is Japan and the knife is the blade is really like a very good quality stainless steel at least for the years that it is and you can see how my father-in-law try and sharpen it with uh, sanding paper but I've got a nice Lansky uh, set that I will make it um, uh, probably 20 or 25 degree angle to a very good sharpness but watch now when I flip it over and there you will see this is a Jet Aero Corporation Patterson J07524 USA so I go into, onto internet and I google the Patterson J knives and everything, everything lead to then that this is an American knife um, and the, I read some history is a guy that uh, start making knives and uh, he tried his best to produce the best possible uh, blades on knives uh, for the users and I can see why because after all these years this is still in a shiny shiny condition and it's a well made knife that's for sure but what makes me wonder is why is there Japan on that side I never could can pick up on, on uh, the site of Patterson that I can see anything about Japan um, coming on there so I have got no idea maybe one of you can give me some information about it why is there maybe it is the steel that came there or maybe it was made on a contract there but I even can't find something like that everything all indications is that it is an American made knife but in any case it's actually a very good knife and I'm going to not in this video I'll probably do it in I will see him in uh, two weeks times so somewhere in between 
I will uh, make it sharp with my Lansky system and give it back to him. But look at this absolute fantastic wood after all these years, at least 20, 25 years as far as, far as me and my wife can say, maybe much older. Okay, my friends, uh, okay guys, I'm just lastly, my OCD was bothering me, that area there was inside was brown and uh, I didn't, I forgot to clean there and now it, that is also okay. So uh, now I'm out and see you on the next one guys, bye bye.